pleasant good morning. Welcome to Transwest Truck Trailer RV. My name is Marlon Bledman for all those tuning in. Uh, I'm going to show you today a 2020 Ford F-150. This one is the King Ranch Edition. I'm going to go over some of the features. Again, if, if in case you guys are interested, my number will be at the bottom of the screen at the end. You can text, email. Also, my email will be there, so you can call, text, email. Um, if you don't get me, leave a message. Send me a text and I'll return your call. So we're gonna go over uh, this truck and uh, if you guys have any questions, feel free to comment on the slot below. This unit is a great unit on our lot right now. Again, very clean. Uh, as you guys can see from the exterior, it does have that pearl white color and it does have those flakes inside that paint as well. So once that sun shine on it at right angle, you will see all those uh, crystals coming out. Um, in the front end, you do have some LED headlamps and fog lamps. You got tow hooks. This one does come with a engine block heater, even though it's a gasser. But this one does come with a 360 camera. So right underneath that Ford sign, you do get that first camera. You do have cameras on either side of those mirrors. And then you got a camera on that rear bumper. We're going to look underneath the hood. And for all those new to Ford, what you guys are looking at right now is a 3.5 liter EcoBoost V6 engine. And it's also partnered with a 10 speed automatic transmission. And a unit like this will produce about 375 horsepower and about 470 foot pounds of torque. And you guys are wondering, what do we do when we get those used units in? We do take it to our local Ford, Ram, Toyota, whatever the brand name is. We do have dealerships close to us that we bring it and we have a good relationship with them as well. We take it over there to run for a PDI or a UVI, which is a used vehicle inspection. They will go over the whole unit, let us know what needs to be done. We'll check some of those boxes out and then we get those done, bring it back on our lot, get it detailed. And then we do videos like this um, once those vehicles are ready. If a unit is very, like somebody really wanted ahead of time, sometimes we do videos before we send it through our, our through the shop but again we try to go through those steps first before we come here but again we do have Carfax reports on those units so if in case you're looking for a Carfax report we could print one out for you as well um, again we went through full service with this one and this one is ready to leave the lot as we speak as we come around previous owner upgraded the tires and rims, so you do have some fuel rims on here. And the tires on here are 275, 70R18s. This one come, comes with parallel parking assist. Uh, so you do have that sensor right here to allow you to sensor those parking and it will assist you in parking in a, in a correct spot. It will actually let you know if you have enough space and then it will assist you going in. F-150 badge with that King Ranch logo. And of course you do have that King Ranch badge also down here. Underneath the mirror is one of those cameras I mentioned earlier. So this is that camera. This one also comes with blank spot monitor, keyless entry, and of course, keypad entry. As we open up the doors, you can see the King Ranch interior. Whenever you see a brown interior like this with those logos on the seats and around, it is the King Ranch. Um, you'll see brown throughout the whole interior. That's just how King Ranch roll. One of the things I want to mention about the seats, the front seats are heated and cool. And it also comes in massage feature. You could go directly onto the screen to turn that feature on. But if you just want to do it manually, this little circle right here, typically that will create that lumbar uh, feature if you don't press this circle you could just use this as your lumbar but if you press this circle it will actually give you the feature for massaging so you do have massage on this unit and this is and then of course it will show up on the screen once we go inside I'll show you guys that again but again this little circle right here will activate the massage seats and deactivate it as well over here you have your powered tilt steering wheel you have adjustable pedals you got powered seats power windows all those powered stuff will all go into that memory bank 
So you do have free settings for memory on this particular unit. So with your mirrors, your steering wheel, your pedals, and your seat, all will save under those banks. So if you have three different drivers or you have three different ways of driving, or you, you just wanna be cool, <laughs> um, you could have three different settings on here. Nice storage down here. And of course you got your power windows, power locks and power mirrors switches up here. This one does come with folding mirrors as well. Let's head to the back. It is a crew cab. So you have tons of room, leg room in the back. Those back seats, those fold up. And you get a flat surface here. You do have a little compartment over here for storage. And of course, in the center here, you have heated seats for the back. So the outer seats are heated. You have 110 plug-in. You got a couple USBs and a 12 volt. You have folding running boards. Your fuel tank, we got a 26 gallon fuel tank on this one. This one is the FX4 off-road package. And for all those who don't know what that is, there is protection, there is kit plates underneath the unit to protect your fuel, transmission, engine, all the things underneath that would need protecting if you do decide to go off-roading a little bit. So you do have that protection underneath that unit. Coming back here, you got your rear camera and that will assist you with that 360 camera view. You got rear sensors, you have a bumpable hitch, and of course, seven pin and a four pin hookup for your trailer. You do have a soft release tailgate with a spray bed liner in there. You have automatic lights if you want to turn those on. You have a switch in here that will turn on those cargo lamps so you don't have to do it inside. It will shut off after a while, so don't worry about forgetting to turn it off. Normally you see those on the 450s or 350s, 250s, but on a 150, some of those units, the upgraded ones, you will get that step. You do have a rear window for the back. And of course you do have the running boards on each side as well. So let's jump inside and go over the interior features. Right now, this unit is actually priced really, really good. If you guys wanna go on the link below and kind of see what those prices are. But this one is priced pretty low right now. So whoever is gonna purchase this unit, I know I had a few calls yesterday, but whoever is gonna purchase this vehicle will get a very good deal on this one. Again, we do offer financing, trade-ins, and of course, delivery anywhere within the US. So feel free to reach out. So when it comes to the interior features, on your steering wheel, you got tons of tons of buttons up here. And I'm just gonna point out what some of those buttons do. On this side, all the buttons over here will control what you see in front of you on your dash. Over here is your cruise control. On this side, on the right-hand side with the volume and, and tracks uh, left and right, there is a mute button as well. I uh, know that one actually, uh, mood button. It will actually change from the different stations from FM, AM to sat satellite radio. But you do have your volume up and down. And then of course you could actually change the stations or change the tracks. This is what it does. And down here is your hands-free calling and voice assist. So you could answer your phone, hang up your phone, mute the stereo or voice command. I'm gonna turn that off. Again, you do have your adjustable electric adjustable steering wheel. I didn't get that. Please try again. Sorry, I don't want you anymore. <laughs> As we continue over here, uh, you do have uh, your 4x4 uh, uh, switch here, so you could turn it from four-wheel drive to four high or low. You have your trailer backup assist. You have your trailer brake right underneath that. Over here, you have a few other buttons here. You got your descent button. Uh, you have your traction control. You got your hazards. Uh, if you have a quick, if you want to view your cameras quickly, you can press this button. You will see that camera, 360 camera view over here. And then of course you got a front view camera as well. You could actually change that if you want. Um, you have your auto shut off switch. 
again once you're driving and you stop at a light or at a crosswalk whatever the case may be um, you'll you'll hear the vehicle kind of cut off for a second and this is what that auto shut off is so if you don't want that you could actually turn it off where you can see that light showing off as we come down all your media controls down here is all your AC controls again you can do all those things via touch screen as well let's go back home um, when it comes to your climate control everything you could do down here you could do it up here again with your phone you could add your phones up here this one does have onboard navigation but it also has Apple and Android capability so you plug in into your USB port down here and then you will get Apple and Android on this unit when it comes to your different apps you could add apps you could um, see the different apps and of course when it comes to your settings you have different settings on here as well all right so this one does have 110 plug-in and of course a uh, 12 volt nice little storage in here that closes with that wood finish cup holders storage lane assist parking assist and it is part of the parking so um, you can signal left or right if you press it again so whatever your signal is is where the sensor will activate so right now I have it on the left if I go to the right it will activate the right sensor so that will assist you in parking parallel parking in certain spots so it's a nice little feature something you could try where there's no vehicles around try it first before you get a cut um, so you could get accustomed with it but a nice little feature especially having a big truck like this and trying to park next to somebody all right so that feature is done in here we got a huge storage box with a nice little tray also has a 12 volt plug-in in here more cup holders in the back we got a nice little glove box in here with all your manuals your owner's manuals a nice little shelf here for smaller items this one does come with that panoramic sunroof and this is one of the features i love especially on my vehicle now with ford if you press this button it will actually stop halfway just to give you that uh, sunroof view but if you press it one more time it'll go all the way to the back and i think ford is the only one i've seen so far that does that um, for you to actually stop it on other vehicles you actually have to hold it and then kind of press it again so it kind of stops um, or it goes all the way backwards or all the way forward so i kind of think that's a, a kind of cool idea but i kind of like the feature that goes all the way back but that's just me universal garage controls up here and then of course you got that rear window and this is that switch for that rear window this unit has 78,941 miles well kept unit always serviced premium sound onboard navigation apple and android capability heated and cool seats 360 camera view and the list goes on and on and on and on so if you guys are interested in this unit it is available as we speak the price has just been dropped down recently so come on text us call us email us my number will be at the bottom of the screen this is a great deal as we speak for the new year uh, hopefully we can earn your business with this one and uh, stay tuned for more videos and more truck videos as the weeks go by thank you very much and i'll see you guys next time